Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am going to discuss about how to fix Modern Warfare 2 crashing problem. If you've got that problem, I'm gonna advise you with a few solutions which you can apply. Hopefully one of them will work for you. Um, the first one, the current fix for Xbox's too early message is to restart the console a few times and keep trying to get it in. Eventually, it will let you in. So keep restarting the campaign, keep restarting until you get in. The second solution which you can apply, first you have to take a look on the system requirement to see if your system meets the minimum requirement. So this is the system requirement here for Windows. Operating system should be Windows 10. The minimum requirement is Windows 10 64-bit latest update. So uh, you need to run the latest update for Windows 10. If you have pending updates, you need to install these updates. I'm gonna guide you how uh, uh, in a while. Regarding the video, NVIDIA GeForce GTX 960 or AMD Radeon RX 470 or DirectX 12.0 compatible system. Storage you need 125 GB. The processor Intel 6100. Memory 8 GB RAM. So guys, take a look at the minimum requirement and see if you meet that requirement. If you don't meet that requirement, let's say if you have still uh, updates that you need to download, go ahead and do that. For the storage, free up some storage which you uh, might be using for apps that you don't really need. So check whatever you can do to meet the minimum requirement. And here on the uh, right hand side you can see the recommended specification. So you can take a look as well to see what is recommended. This part is the minimum and this one is the recommended. So after you take a look on the system requirements, let's go now and apply a few solutions. So I'm gonna minimize this page. Now, if you are uh, playing this game through Battle.net or Epic Games or Steam or through whatever platform, you can apply the same. Go to Battle.net uh, icon, click on it, and then right-click and go to Properties, and then go to Compatibility, and then here select Disable Full Screen Optimization and run this program as an administrator. Both options, select them and then click Apply, and then click on OK. When you're done with this solution, now uh, go ahead and check if uh, your Windows is up to date. So go to the search toolbar and type Windows update. You will see as a best match, check for updates, click on that. And here click on check for updates. If you've got any update, then go ahead and run and install those updates. Once this is done, go to the toolbar here, right click on it and click on task manager. I'm going to maximize the page and here you will see on the processes the apps that are running. You need to free up as much space as you can uh, so you can play the game. How you can free up spaces that you don't really need. Let's say I'm going to choose this app here, right click on it and click on end task. So when you end the task of any app, it will close it and eventually you are freeing up spaces to be used by the game. Make sure you don't close up the game itself or the platform that you are using to play the game like Battle.net or Steam. Once this is done, another solution which you can apply, type Device Manager. Device Manager, you will see it as a best match, click on it. And here go to Display Adapters and then select the option that you have below Display Adapters, right click on it and click on Update Driver. Click on search automatically for drivers. Windows has determined that the best driver for this device is already installed. If you've got another message that there is a driver to be installed. So if you've got another message that the, you need to update the driver, go ahead and do that. Follow the process and update your driver. Once this is done, the last solution which you can apply is to check if the antivirus in your system may be blocking some parts of the app causing this issue. So what you need to do in this case, go to the search toolbar and type Windows Security. Windows Security as a best match, you will see it here, click on it. Click on Virus and the Threat Protection. And here scroll down and click on Manage Settings. Scroll down and then click on Add or Remove Exclusions. Click on add an exclusion and insert the game in the exclusion so Windows Defender does not block the game while uh, you are playing or while you are trying to launch it. And that is about it. With that, I have come to the end of this video. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel to watch upcoming videos. Take care. Goodbye.